You probably have heard of the 18-year-old all-around gold medalist named Sunisa Lee. She is well known by millions for her special talent in gymnastics. Getting an all-around gold medal at just the age of 18 is impressive and inspiring to people like me. I started dancing at age three when my parents put me in the sport. I began training as it progressed, and as it progressed, I saw improvement in my performance. I also know a little bit of acro from previous training. In addition to that, Sunisa Lee is motivating through her amazing talent shown at the Olympics in Tokyo, Japan. She also overcame many challenges throughout her life, which didn't stop her from being committed to gymnastics. These challenges helped her become a better person and also has helped her personally develop. Through her excellent performance, she put forth a positive example towards the world. Sunisa not only achieved her goal of becoming an Olympian, but she bravely dealt with adversity and was selfless throughout her training progressions. There's so much exertion and dedication it takes to receive a gold medal just as Lee did. In fact, she has spent her entire life working for that moment. Sunisa Lee's competitive career and development as a gymnast has grown exponentially in a short amount of time. First of all, Sunisa began her competitive career at the age of 14, which was in 2017, when she made the junior national team. In 2018, at the Pacific Rim Junior Championships, she won three silver medals and one gold for the team. At the 2019 Geloso Cup trophy, she won an all-around gold at the team event. As she prepared for the 2019 U.S. National Championships, she suffered from an ankle injury. However, she still won one bronze, two silver, and two gold medals at the championship. She competed passionately despite her minor injuries. Her well-deserved performance earned her a spot on the national team, and this is what qualified her for the 2020 Tokyo Olympics. She even outscored Biles and at the U.S. Olympic team trials. She came in second behind Biles on the first day results and came in first on the second day results. Throughout her career, she knew that she had to work hard to succeed at something that she was good at and loved doing. In the future, I aspire to be like Sunisa Lee, who has become rep a representation of confidence to everyone worldwide. She has allowed many to become a proud athlete like her. Sunisa Lee was born and raised in Minnesota, where she was a part of a large community of Hmong Americans. They are an Asian ethnic group. Lee's parents fled from Laos as children at the beginning of the Vietnam War. Then they went to Thailand refugee camps. From there, they headed to Minnesota, which is where most Hmong Americans live. In addition to this, I admire Sunisa Lee because she's a very selfless as a gymnast. She went to the gym every single day for all the parents like hers who immigrated to the US with nothing. She underwent painful practices for her father who put her in gymnastics at a young age. She represents all Americans and the US gymnastics team by showing that she is capable of receiving a gold medal. By doing this, she achieved her goal of becoming an Olympian at only age 18. Being an Olympian means everything to her because it was her lifelong goal. She underestimated herself not being able to believe her accomplishments. She didn't even think that she would possibly be competing for a gold medal. She was convinced she'd compete for a silver medal. Lee was hoping for silver because Simone Biles was known for being a gold champion in gymnastics. On the day of competition, Simone Biles withdrew from the Olympics because she was not in her best mental state. After a vault event that was not her best performance, she decided it would be best to quit. Sunisa Lee felt super pressured, so she stepped up when Simone Biles stepped down from the team. The adversity that Sunisa Lee has dealt with has been challenging for her. Her father, who was her biggest motivation, got injured on his spine from a fall off a ladder in August 2019. She had wished that her father, John Lee, had come to see her perform at Tokyo because that's what they had planned earlier in her life, but he was unable to. During 2020, she could not properly train for gymnastics because her gym was closed most of the year. Although, when she got back to training in the gym, she had broken her ankle. She also faced a challenge that many elite gymnasts did, which was awaiting the postponed 2020 Tokyo Olympics, rescheduled for July 2021. With slow healing and lots of pressure for the big Olympics event, Sunisa thought about quitting gymnastics some days. She didn't think her ankle would ever heal, but she didn't quit. This is what's so inspiring about her, that she never gave up even at her lowest. Gymnastics is a sport with many risks and injuries. It is a commitment that all gymnasts must make. To conclude, Sunisa Lee achieved her goal of becoming a gold medalist. She dealt with challenges that made her a stronger person, and she worked hard throughout her career. Also, through her performance at the Olympics, she knew that it was all worth it in the end when she got a gold medal. Her amazing hard work, dedication, and selflessness were demonstrated throughout her life. 
She had worked her entire life to make everyone around her proud, and it shows through her excellent performance. It also proves that her hardworking self led to success in the end. Sunisa faced a lot of challenges throughout her life on top of getting many injuries from gymnastics. Through it all, she tried to stay positive. These traits inspired me a lot about her. I will be taking questions and feedback. Sophia? Um, I admire her hardworking self and a lot of her traits. Sloan? Um, the question was, have, has I, have I ever done gymnastics before? And um, I used to go to summer camps when I was younger. Thank you.